elder exhibitions are usually planned a year out, and then with the virus and uncertainty in terms of planning, we sort of put our exhibitions for the fall on hold. As I was thinking about it over the summer, I started to look around my house and uh, I noticed like this was the, it was the only artwork I was really seeing in person. And I thought more about how I was really taking that work under new consideration. We're living in it, we're quarantining, you know, and we're spending so much time at home. And so I thought that a good exhibition for the return to school would be kind of bringing our home to school. And so I asked the rest of the faculty in the art department and the staff in the art department and also the staff of the gallery if they wanted to participate. Everybody cobbled together stuff that they care about. Just started to kind of organize it and figure if there's ways that some of these things go together. Some of the stuff is fine art. Some of the stuff is just objects, right? Some of the stuff that also included is stuff that's part of, that makes Nebraska Wesleyan home. So it's part of the permanent collection. We have ceramic objects, paintings, small little drawings. I have a, a drawing that was made by my father when he was in art school that he never you know, showed and I was able to kind of put that here. These beautiful ducks that were hand carved by our visiting art history professor's father. And it's just like all types of really kind of interesting stuff. The theme that runs through it really is the reminder of the lived with and also the kind of carefully curated in the most domestic sense, the way we curate our homes. I think the, the idea of intermingling what we normally know as art and how we show it in Elder versus other types of objects in an art context will be something that we'll continue to do because there's no real theme other than, you know, stuff from home, kind of like a potluck, bringing it to share with other people and there's a certain magic to the show. Mm -hmm.